Hello and welcome. The much awaited NetExpress with .NET 5.1 product is now out and it's loaded with features. With the extended support for .NET, it now supports up to .NET version 3.5. And let's not forget the integration with Visual Studio 2008. You can now build WPF and WCF applications with COBOL. Today we are joined by John Billman, who is a product manager for the NetExpress with .NET product, and Peter Anderton, who is a product solutions director for application development. Let's hear it from them. What's the big news here? Next up, John Billman. With MicroFocus NetExpress with .NET 5.1, COBOL is inside the .NET framework. That means that you can use the highly productive Visual Studio 2008 to develop and to modernize and extend your COBOL applications. It also means that because COBOL is now a first-class citizen inside of .NET, you can gain access to all of the features and functionality of the .NET framework directly from COBOL such as, for example, WPF, the Windows Presentation Foundation. COBOL is known for its solid, proven business processes, for high performance, for its data processing. About 70% of all of the data in the world is processed from COBOL applications. But those applications are not necessarily known for their contemporary look and feel, with older green screen user interfaces and 10 to 15 year old GUIs. Well, now using NetExpress with .NET and WPF, you can build a truly contemporary, Vista-like user interface in COBOL for that key application functionality, improving the productivity and competitiveness of those applications. At the same time, these core business processes written in COBOL need to be used across the enterprise and outside the enterprise in other organizations as well. By using COBOL together with WCF, the Windows Communication Foundation, COBOL processes can be exposed as web services. That means they can be accessed by other technologies on other platforms in other languages. So with a contemporary IDE for development, COBOL inside .NET, WPF providing a modern look and feel, and agile business processes through web services, your existing and new investments that you make in COBOL can be very strategic for the future. So John's already told you about NetExpress with .NET, but at 5.1 there are also improvements to Surfer Express and NetExpress. There's about a thousand small improvements and enhancements to the code. There are, is a roll-up of the web fix, so it has the latest enhancements and improvements in the software. And it's being made available on 57 different enterprise class platforms. This will also be the platform for future growth and future enhancements because as we go through this calendar year, we'll be making available add-ons and a new IDE Eclipse. So the add-ons MicroFocus XDBC. XDBC allows you to access COBOL data from JDBC or ODBC applications or dashboards. So this allows other parts of the enterprise and people who don't have COBOL skills to access the data that's in the COBOL programs. And the other enhancements, the other add-ons we're making available is the MicroFocus database connectors, which are available for Oracle, DB2, and Microsoft X, uh, SQL. And they'll be available in the September-October time frame. And then as we close the year out, we'll be making available the Eclipse IDE. So as today you've heard about the Microsoft Visual Studio 2008 IDE, at Christmas we'll be making this uh, uh, available on Eclipse. Now what's important about these is these fit on top of 5.1. These are 5.1 add-ons and en enhancements and we're already starting the Early Adopter Program. So if you'd like to find out more uh, details about the Early Adopter Program, please contact MicroFocus and we'd love to have you involved. Thank you, Peter. I hope you have enjoyed listening to Peter and John as much as I have. We have uploaded our latest 5.1 launch webcast to our website. If you'd like to view it, please visit us at www.microfocus.com. Thank you.